for this problem right here, your v is given by a piecewise function of s. So for the first half, when s is between 0 and 200 meter, this is a linear function. Actually, both equations are linear. The first one has a slope of 40 minus 20 over 200 minus 0. So this is a um, 0 0.1. So this is going to be 0 0.1 s plus a constant. And when uh, s equals to 0, v equals to 20. So this constant right here is 20. So this is when s is between 0 and 200 meter. For the second equation, the slope is going to be a negative from 40 to 10, so negative 30 divided by from 600 to 200, uh, that's 400 right here. So that's going to be um, negative 0.075s plus also a constant to determine the constant when s equals to 200, v equals to 40. So uh, from some simple calculation, this constant is 55. Okay, you can verify that when s equals to 600, if you plug in negative 0 0.075 times 600 plus 55, that will give you 10 back. That's v at s equals to 600. So this is uh, when s is between 200 meter and uh, 600 meter. So from the graph, we can read these two linear equations. Um, we need to find AS function. So we need to use this relation that ADS equals to VDV. The other two, V equals to DS DT and A equals to DV DT, these two equations at this point don't really help us because as you can see, we do not need T, we do not need time. Our, this problem doesn't concern time. Therefore, we don't need that. So we need to figure out how we can manipulate this relation in order to get a S function. Because V is given as functions of S, so we can do this. We can simply divide the equation by ds on both sides. So on the left-hand side, we only have a left. On the right-hand side, we will have v times dv ds. And because v is given as a function of s, therefore, this part right here actually is only going to be a function of s. So this actually is a, not a very difficult problem. So for the first half, when s is between 0 and 200 meter, a equals to v, which is 0 0.1 s plus 20 times dv ds, which is, according to this equation, dv ds is simply 0 0.1. Therefore, this equals to 0 0.01 s plus 2. And then when s is between 200 and 600 meter, same thing, a equals to v dv ds, and v is given by negative 0 0.075 s plus 55, this equation right here multiply by dv ds and again according to this equation dv ds equals to negative 0 0.075 and this equals to 0 0.005625 and then minus 4.125 therefore we got the as function again piecewise function the first equation is 0 0.01s plus 2. That is when s is between 0 and 200 meter. Second equation, 0 0.005625. Um, excuse me. I have an s here. I forgot an s. Times s minus 4.125. 
and this is when s is between 200 and 600 meter. So again, now we have found the piecewise function, the piecewise as function. And if you have a function, you can sketch it. So you can tell that both equations are linear equations and the slope for both equations are positive. So the graph looks something like this. This is A, this is S. When S equals to 200, there's going to be some step change. This is when S equals to 600. So the graph will look like this.